Nicola Sturgeon's independence on shaky path as debate must identify Russian actors MP. Social media bosses must ensure the correct systems are in place to prevent Russian meddling in the Scottish independence debate and any future referendum, Express has been told. New research suggests that replacing Prime Minister Boris Johnson with one of the frontrunners for the Tory leadership would only boost support for independence in Scotland. A poll of 1,029 Scottish adults found that, should Chancellor of the Exchequer Rishi Sunak take over as Prime Minister, 13% of Scots said they would be more likely to support a yes vote. This is compared to 6% who said they would be more likely to oppose independence. The percentage increases when Liz Truss is thrust into the frame. The YouGov poll found that her successful campaign would push 15% of Scots towards supporting leaving the UK while just 5% would be more likely to vote no. Talk around Scottish independence has rekindled since the country's national parties held their respective conferences late last month. The Scottish National Party, SNP, and the Scottish Greens confirmed that there were no plans to stall moving towards holding an INDI of 2 in 2023, despite the growing international disaster in Ukraine fallout from the coronavirus pandemic and a cost of living crisis. The war in Ukraine has dug up old concerns about Russia's involvement in Scotland. Specifically a 2020 report that concluded that the Kremlin tried to influence the result of its 2014 independence referendum in favour of independence. It described how the committee found it was potentially the first post-Soviet interference in a Western democratic election. While the report did not go into the specifics of the interference, with much of its contents redacted by the UK government. Experts had previously claimed that Russia's efforts were focused on a disinformation campaign online. Now, as the independence debate picks up again, John Lamont, the Scottish Conservative MP for Berwickshire, Roxburgh and Selkirk, has urged social media platforms to ensure that the interference does not happen again calling for better online defences and for disinformation to be thwarted before it spreads, he told Express. The report demonstrates that Putin wants to create as much disruption and chaos as he possibly can.